As usual, you have your lens down, you click on video, the next thing you do is how it is. Can someone remember what to use for input? If you talk about input, what do you use? Input, the next thing is type, right? Then what about the, when we are talking about the navigation? When we are talking about the, when we talk about navigation or link? Do you remember what to use for link? Is it SRC? What do you use for link? Who can still remember? I want you to always be understanding this because they go hand in hand, okay? They go hand in hand. For example, when you talk about link, you talk about it, address, okay? You talk about address, H R E S, okay? But in video, what do you do? You talk about stocks. And what about image? When you talk about image, what do we what do you use when we are talking about image? Do you still remember? When you're talking about image session? Who can still remember? When you talk about image. Image, image, image. Anybody who can remember when you talk about image? Uh-huh. Image, we're talking about image. Do you remember image? Okay. If you don't remember, go back, make sure you remember all these things because they will help you. Okay. Or you can simply type it there and we tell you. For example, the image. We will show you what to use as an image. Okay. So from this, you understand. Image talk about stocks. Image is stocks. Image is stocks. Video is stocks. But then image, you have Okay, but the video only stop. So you, you might be right on, but you're writing on, you will put it there at the major if you the two videos, if you the closing tag of video. Okay, are you getting it? So video is source, image is source. Why? If you talk about this, if you're talking about this, talk about that, then you talk about the uh, 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 link, you talk about click and rec. So don't forget, these are the terms that are important. It's terms that you must use when you are coding. So talk about a video. Like I said, then maybe you can see your video. Maybe you have a personal video on your laptop that you want to showcase. Maybe there's a review for product, or maybe your training session, maybe other things, maybe funny thing that was happening to your site. So you know the advantage of video. You know, you know why video is very, very important. Sometimes talk at the beginning, talk at the end, talk, you know. So video can never not be overemphasized. The need of video in your website cannot be overemphasized. So how do you work with video? First of all, you you that's your lesson thing. Type video, if you're not using GS code, type video. Next, you start, you keep a space, SRC, it's possible, then your video will be here. Okay? If you're going, if you're going from the URL, from the URL, you got the video and bring it from, from your, from your, from your system, you can also type it here. So, without wasting time, without much ado, let's go. So, let's go and Now let's save and see what will happen. Let's save. 
usual. Uh, let's go to live server. See what will happen. As our video appears, we appear, it did not appear. Let's go down. If I do it, oh, the video has appeared. Very beautiful. The video comes up. But you notice something. This is the video. This is the video. You know? Now, click anywhere. Is it playing? The answer is no. The video is not playing. And you may be wondering, how can I install video and it's not playing? Yes, there's a reason why the video is not playing. It's because we've not given the video the necessary control. We've not told HTML what to do with the video. So now HTML feels just like an image. You have to put controls so I can play. Controls enable users to play the video, watch the video, see the video. We are coming. Let's start with control press. So type control. So type control, press space here, put control. Just make sure you bring input. After input, you type the name and all those stuff. Same thing. You can put it here. You can also put it begin and mail after the video. You can put it here. Any place you put it, it will work. Okay. Just nothing like should be at the end. It can be here. Once you put a space and you put control here to work. You come over here, put a space to control here to work. Okay. So controls. Controls. Once you click on controls, save it. Let's go back to the video again. You see it. It has put the control now. Let me make it better. You see it. See the controls now. So somebody can play the video. Let's play it. Let's play it. Greetings from Seven Training in Digital Marketing. Do you wish to master digital marketing techniques in order to expand your company? Do you possess any talents that you have that you believe the public will find useful? Do you owe a laptop or a smartphone that you can use? Do you enjoy browsing? Now we're talking about online browsing, like checking your Facebook, checking your WhatsApp, your Google, and all that. What other do you have a strong desire to, to pick up any practical skills? Let me pause the technology stuff because it's very important and important. I don't get to that. Let's pause the technology stuff. So, I'm giving you controls, and with that controls, you can actually play the video. But what else can we do with the video? What else apart from control? There are many other things can do the video. Do you know that not putting control as an advantage? For example, they have some videos on your website I don't want people to watch. If you don't want people to watch it, you won't put this control. You don't put control, it will be like the way it was normally. They just look like ordinary videos on your video. But controls enable users to play the video, forward it, and do anything with the video. Okay? So if you don't want just to play the video there, they don't want people to watch it, fine, don't put control. If you want people to watch it, put controls. Are you getting me what I'm saying? So I'm just trying to tell you when you can put control and when you don't need to put control. That control now enables the person, the person can play any part of the video, you can scroll it, you can hold it, you can make it full screen, full uh, uh, common full screen, you can make it fast pay anything you want to do. You can now have a control, you have to have the control to make it. Okay? That's the essence of giving control to your video. So you are giving them the right to use your video the way they like. Now the next thing you notice is that now and desire to learn it and make sure that you become somebody you used to become something in your future even in your life right now would you like to triple your current income or are you looking for extra Sometimes, so that will just give you a hint and you know, automatically you might talk to others. So if I give you a hint, for instance, say you're doing this, if I give you a hint, for instance, say you're doing this, okay? So for this one, let's not do this. Let's do this. Just same after control, press uh, space bar, then width, okay? Let's put the width of the video to be, let's say, straight tip, okay? Straight tip, this thing, you know? So let's put it like that. Type your controls. You notice something? My video has adjusted to more than that. Let me let me make it better again. You know, so I can now see my videos everywhere. I can see who is there. I can control the video. I can even see that the video is is is, is in line with uh, my file put file uh, button for me and the rest of it. That means that the video is what it's an inline element. What is what element? It doesn't make any sense now. So if I want the video to what element? What do I do? Do you remember? You can use this. Can use this, which will help the video to make it to drop on. So let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. So you see why it has been you are to have a small screen, make it smaller so you can see what is there, know how it's happening there, okay? So let's use this. Yes, please. If I believe you know, if you don't know it, go back to that class, don't forget.
just look out to that class where you talk about commission, how you can commission, how you can structure your HTML, go back to that class and learn this. Okay. But I believe all of us here knows this thing. So let's put it on this. So that way we can be able to work with our video very well. Let's put it on div. Let's delete this. Now oh, I appear, you know, it already. Mm, so everything will be okay. So, contrast, I want to come to the next page, okay? So, I drop it. So, I can use it like that time after this. So, you can add the control, you can play it, you can change the volume, you can make it higher, make it lower, you can make it big, you can come over to this and we download the music, play back to it, picture in picture, you can do anything. But I'll give you control and I'll give you the lead as well. So, but is that all you can do with video? They ask like you. There are still more things. The only thing happened on video I can tell you is that the way I do the video, you just need to press space and everything will press this side by this door, everything like this, like this, like this. Uh -huh. There is what we call poster. If you put the poster, maybe put it in thumbnail, something that will make people know what the video is all about. Do I have any thumbnail here? We can use one as an, as an instance. So to do that, simply come over, we are still here, before control, you can after control in case you want to put it, just come over here, write poster, okay? Poster. Poster. Then what do I need to put here? I want to put a thumbnail that I have, thumbnail.jpg. Thumbnail.jpg, okay? So this thumbnail, we show up on now, once you put it there, then control, also, usual save. Now, did you notice something? The video has changed. You know, putting my picture in, I see the thumbnail. The thumbnail, maybe, maybe what your video is all about. You have a video, your picture all about the video. For example, say you see it now, it has changed. You know, same just the first page is my, my picture, you see this. That maybe the video has to do with SEO, maybe I have to use H1, coding lesson, SEO lesson, design lesson, community lesson, search. You know, so you kind of blueprint of what you are teaching, okay? So, same thing you can see play click on play and click play okay it doesn't greetings anything. from C it doesn't change anything. the youtube market do you wish to master are you hearing it, it does not change you to expand your company you can you can you can decide to forward it fast forward it fight or other facets of your goals so that company just seven to understand it starts with only you know you are kind of uh, putting putting beauty on your video so if you have something like company Go ahead and do just what I do. And what you can do with this video is you notice know, something? If I open the video, it doesn't start playing unless you click on play. But for some reason, maybe you may try that or soon as somebody comes to your website and open your website, you should start playing. <laughs> How do you achieve that? Because you just don't need to go and click. You mean you open your website, the video will start playing, they'll start hearing you, any advice or whatever you want to hear. You know, maybe your comment address or whatever. You know, how do you do that? You can do that by what we call autoplay, okay? Autoplay. So with autoplay, you can actually achieve that. So let's use autoplay, okay? This autoplay. So autoplay means automatically play. So by the time we save it, you see what will happen. Save. Greetings from Greetings CNC training, from Seven training in my YouTube market. Do you wish you to master, to master YouTube YouTube marketing, marketing techniques? Yeah, just find your company. Your company. Do you possess, Do you any, possess talents any talents that you have that, that you believe the you public will find useful? Do you own a laptop, you own a laptop, own a laptop a smartphone, a smartphone you can use? Can use? Do you enjoy browsing? Is that the only thing talking about that online browsing, like video. taking your Facebook, taking your WhatsApp, your Google, and all that? Do you have a strong... And after you can pass your video, you can make it to look. For example, as of, as your, sometimes maybe your website, you don't want the video to stop, the part to stop. Like when you go to bank, that walking into a bank, you are doing your payment. The bank, your video will keep on talking, 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 talking. Nobody's controlling it. It's used loop. So that loop, whenever the video, once it gets to the end, it starts all over from the beginning. Just play it all over from the beginning. You don't need to sorry to be controlling it. Yet. How do you achieve that? Let me show you in a jiffy. Just come over here and type loop, okay? Type loop. That's all. They meant to type loop. And let's now go over, save this first, save your work first, save your work first. Then let's 
come over to the video and see what will happen when the video gets to the end and then part of it just be patient a little and see it greetings you're almost, almost to the end talking about digital marketing talking about freelancer let me take you to my system now and show you how this is done i want to take you to my system and show you how you can greetings from seven training in digital marketing when it got to the end what happened it looked all over it starts all over again that's another thing that i thought you can give your video are you learning something if you are learning something give me a thumbnail okay give me a shout out click that notification button subscribe if not done so and put on the alert bell so once i review any video you see but i mean business i will teach you i will teach you for free i will teach you everything about html then we proceed to css then we proceed to javascript we will build a video we will build a complete website at the end of the day we will run a big project so that one may likely involve we will going to build a youtube this youtube video are using today will build a youtube website from the scratch and it will work with you like this using only coding not using wordpress no coding so you have a lot to learn from me please continue learning as you see you actually continue progression thank you so much let's continue let's continue because we still have some few things to learn okay so there are many things that you can do with your video you can endorse all here but don't forget your best friend google 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 search on youtube learn many things on your own practice 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 okay so that is all about video, but it doesn't end there. there. You know that you can also go to YouTube and bring a video from YouTube. Maybe your video from YouTube or someone video from YouTube and put it on, 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 on your own website. I want person come to your site. Maybe if you, are, you don't have your video, you actually collect from YouTube. How do you do that? Come on, let's continue. Another beautiful thing is that you can actually purchase content from YouTube, a video from YouTube, maybe your own video or other video from YouTube and place it on your website. And it will still complete. YouTube actually gives you that opportunity and they will give you all their feature. How do you do that? How can you bring YouTube code? They will give you a code. How can YouTube give you a code that you're going to bring to your HTML and place it as your code and it will work and it will start to all the video of YouTube inside your own website, also this system that we are building now. It's the website we are building now. Let us, without much ado, let's go over there. Let's turn you over, turn over with me, go to YouTube. Choose any video you like. I've already selected a video, so I've already wasted much of your time. This is the video I want to choose. The video is, is digital marketing a good career? Is digital marketing a good career? Let's just play the video a little so you understand. What product to it. Is digital marketing a good so career? You do, that is the. you open the video like this, you come to share. You see share? You click on share. When you click on share, you see YouTube has a place for you for you to embed the video. Yeah, you can actually share the video to WhatsApp, to Twitter, and the rest of it. But now we want to embed it. We want to take the video to our own website. So click on embed. Click on where? Embed. You might click on embed. You come over here. Then we, YouTube will give you, look at look at the code. This is HTML code, okay? Uh, HTML code, we give this iframe. iframe, I will teach you iframe. Don't worry, I spend time on this. It's HTML. I'm going to wrap up HTML for both to CSS and to CSS. Go to CSS. So, iframe is just another kind of thing that enables you to carry some one website and put it in your own website. Maybe a whole website put on your own website. So, from your website, they can go to that, view everything about that person's website on your own website. For example, you will think sometimes you want to pay me money, you want to transfer money, maybe you are Jumia, you bought something in Jumia, you want to pay them, and you merely you click, you take it to your bag. Maybe you use a Visa card, MasterCard. What does it do? Draw the WhatsApp or Visa card to you. You start out to you pay your money on bank. Your bank will accept it. Everything is done. And you know, that is iPhone. That's the just example of iPhone. Maybe that's a just example. So I'll keep you here on iPhone completely. So what you do is you check all the controls. The objective that you should give you the controls. You can get more you like. Like start as the time you want it to start, show player, enable privacy, and this is anyone you want, you click on it. No, I want to tick. If you don't want it, you remove the ticking. Okay, no, you want to tick. Show player control, you tick on it. So once you finish ticking the ones you want, you now come over and click on copy. Okay. The moment you copy it, now come back to your site. So follow me. Let's go back to our HTML site. Come over here. Come over here. You see it. We are still under the body. Okay. Then you paste it here. Control P for paste. You paste it here. 
save it save it once you save it you scroll down let me put that you see let me make it in a very big so i see you see it see it here click on it is digital marketing a good career that is the topic of this video we're going to be talking about all the most important things associated with digital marketing like salary job satisfaction demand and other x factors and by the end of this video you are going to have a very good idea whether digital marketing is a good career and specifically a good career fit for you or not so if you like videos like this go ahead gently tap that like button and let me know down in the comments below and let's get into it all right so first of all let's answer the question what exactly is digital marketing it refers to the use of digital channels in order to market a product to a customer base so if you see your own website and as usual you can also put all the other necessary controls like teach you so once people come there to start playing right away okay so this is all about video using html to code video on your own website are you following me so don't forget can also do a contact if you scroll down you scroll down you can see put the size you see you can put the size you can see you can see the size of the design if you still want to know more, please don't forget your head, your brain head, those things. Okay, don't forget to put it as well. I just put this video that came out with this channel that came out with this video that came out with this channel. Anything you might can see in the channel right here, or you want to do it like this, or you want to draw it. Once again, thank you for listening to my channel. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. Thank you for being there, for being learning about what you want to do. If you get what I'm talking about today, please don't forget to give up on me. Keep on subscribing, keep on clicking, keep on sharing, keep on telling your friends about this because I will teach you how to code. I will teach you how to code like ABC. Besides, I'm going to show you how to code and how you can become a good developer or you can become a good social media. I will teach you from, from this channel. You're going to see us here from the next one. You're going to see Python. So don't worry. Stay with me. You will learn a lot from me. But if you are not interested in coding, you want to learn how to build your own website, I'm coding, I'm teaching you coding at all. This is me, this is Kama Marketing. Go to my other channel, okay? I'm also creating a channel for you so you can click on the channel and then I'll teach you how to build your own website without having to use any technology. If you want to get it done, how you can build a very powerful, powerful, good website, beautiful website for people, for company, for friends. I will teach you all that. If you need to purchase that, you have to go to all of my stuff, the Kama Marketing channel, okay? So I have a lot for you. Give me the time, give me your time, watch my videos, subscribe to me, tell people about me, thank you once again, thank you for listening to my videos, stay glowing.